Hi. Uh, we're right here. Halo 4, I mean Halo 3 here. Guess what? It sucks! Oh my god! This game, I spent, I spent like 30 or 40 dollars on it, and it sucks! It's, 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 it's. Okay, let's start up on this. Um, let's see. The weapon. The sniper. Was horrible. It was, uh, I mean, it's exactly like the Halo 2 one. But worse. You're like, it's just fast, but horrible aiming. Horrible, and the pistol, oh my god. That was like the worst gun in Halo history. It's just like this. At least the Halo 2 is like, it's like a machine gun or something. And let's see. Uh, yeah, oh yeah, the power things, like the bubble shield and stuff. I haven't played Halo 3 in a long time, but yeah. So like the bubble shield was okay. Grab lift, horror, hor well, no, not the grab lift, um, flare. You can't, if you can't paint, the flare doesn't even do anything on the computer. Which makes no sense. That's why I hit the flare. And the, um, power drain, you can destroy it. That's, that's stupid. Oh my god. And, uh, the, uh, radar jammer, that was just dumb. That was just plain dumb. I don't know who came up with that. That was just plain dumb. Uh, so, yeah, now to the storyline. Yeah, uh, wait, okay, the storyline. It was okay, I mean, I mean, but, really, uh, it was okay. But, at the last level, I mean, what am I saying? <laughs> uh, let's go. Let's skip the storyline because the storyline actually made sense. Uh, so yeah, it just sucks. And I paid a bunch of money. So let's go to matchmaking. If you betray a teammate, you get booted. It makes no sense. I don't think in Halo 2 they had that. I'm not sure. But you can get booted if you betray a teammate. Like one time, I threw a, a I threw a grenade right up in the air. It was a plasma grenade, and I stuck my teammate, and I got booted for that. I mean, if you don't see it, don't boot them. I don't I don't do that unless they do it on purpose. That's the only reason you can boot them. But Bungie, that was a stupid idea of getting booted. Booting So yeah, and the weapons. Oh wait, I already did that. But the weapon sucks. I'm just gonna say that. And the landmine. It blew up. It blew up before it, someone even stepped on it. That was that was stupid. And like in the Halo Reach one, I like the Halo Reach landmine way better. Because they don't they um you don't have to put them down just to uh get activated. If you're doing like a race map and you want landmine. You don't have to put it down. You don't have to put it down like that. With the landmine, with the Halo Reach landmine, you just spot it with Forge, and it'll just gonna stay there. And the Forge. Horror! That is, the Forge is probably the worst thing in the whole game. If you don't have a map pack, the mythic map pack, I think you can't even build your creation. You can't, you can't. Like the Halo, you can't even, um, what the heck? Oh, yeah, okay, you can't even, what the heck is wrong with the computer?
stuff you have to do. Okay. You can't even, you can't even create anything you want. I mean, like with the halo, like with the halo through um reach one, you actually can create your own buildings, and you don't even need a map pack. Seriously. Come on, that was like the worst thing in the Halo 3. Oh my god, that... You only could spawn like weapons, vehicles, the uh, invisibility, bomb stuff. You couldn't, um, add any creation, any whatsoever, to the map. Gosh, oh, so, that's basically all the Wait, the armory. Yeah. Not. I like the Halo Reach armor a lot, a lot better. Because you just had, you didn't have to get any skulls. You didn't have to get any skulls in the Halo Reach. You just play, you play campaign, firefight, matchmaking, and custom games. Wait, I don't think it was firefight. No, not firefight. So it was only matchmaking care campaign and custom games. You can get a bunch of credits that buys you uh uh armor. Yeah. But with the Halo 3 one you had to unlock gold, you had to unlock achievements. That was stupid. And armory didn't even look like real armory. Easy A just looks like a big helmet that'll get you sniped with a bunch of circles inside of it. So, ah, uh, okay, Halo, Halo 3 sucks, whatsoever. And plus, Halo Reach had a lot more armor, like the CQC, what else did it have The CQC, the, the, wait, wait, the Noble Six Helmet, the Commando Helmet, the Air Assault Helmet, uh, the Grenader Helmet, I forgot the haunted helmet. It had so much helmet, and it and the helmets in Halo Reach look so uh, um better in Halo Reach and Halo Reach because they had scratches. They had um army battle, so army march. So Halo Reach, Halo Reach up here. Have it. Have it. It's yours. It's yours. Have it. Have it, it's yours. I, I don't want it. Have it. It's yours. 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 Just take it. Just take it. Just take it. Halo Reach.